So it's literally been like 30 minutes. No, you're not going in there, buddy. There's nails everywhere. You see all those? You can't go in there. Okay, I did give her $100 on Venmo because they're so, so kind. It's a 1984 J something pop-up. Jayco? Jayco pop-up? I don't know, but there it is. It's right there with us. Hi! <laughs> so we have some work to do on it because it was free. And we're really excited about that because we like to work, we like to create, and we like to do things. gonna crawl in there or what do you think happens? Row! Row! Trendy! Oh no. How do I feel about this stove thingy? You have to like Maybe I all the way out. Oh, there it is. Yeah, they said that the, the heater was finicky. Good thing I know a guy for that. You know a guy for that? Jacob. Just looks really <laughs> trending. <laughs> what are we gonna do first? All right, clean it. <laughs> clean Rip it. Rip everything out. Take all the cabinets out. Start sliding them down. Think okay. about our possible floor adoptions. I think we need to make room in the garage. We I can't, think we're really we can't leave start everything out here. Thinking about the canvas and. Uh, how much you're willing today. to spend on a canvas because this trailer I'm willing to spend $999 because I told him it was going to be under a thousand <laughs> sounds like too much for me. and then I mean today we could probably start taking some stuff out and cleaning it right we don't have anything else to do today overwhelm <laughs> sets in <laughs> so it's literally been like 30 minutes no, you're not going in there, buddy. There's nails everywhere. You see all those? You can't go in there. So, so far, we have taken everything out of the camper. It's all right here. Taken everything out. We've taken all the doors and hinges off of everything and we are going to sand all the wood down and then we're going to paint the hardware we're going to um, primer and paint the cabinets to go get our floors for the RV. Floor decor. But first, <laughs> are you gonna windshield wipe it off? Alrighty, so this is after we got the flooring. We were putting down the subfloor after ripping up all of the old yellowing 1984 vinyl linoleum tile thing that was going on there. <clears throat> so this was all pretty easy. We just laid out the plastic and then Robert cut um, the areas around it for the pipes that were coming through and areas for the furniture and all of that good stuff. Right. 
So we are inside, as you can see, painted everything white. So today, on the list for today, I've got to fix these countertops because they're just this beautiful 1980s yellowing vinyl sticky stuff. <laughs> Okay, so I've got to do that. And then I just took the measurements to make a bench cushion right here, a bench cushion right here, a bench cushion right here. Because we got this, I'm not gonna walk over here, we don't have the stabilizers on, but uh, this bed has gotten really wet. Um, I don't know if you guys can see this little hole right here. This hole has been <laughs> allowing rain to get in on the bed. Thankfully it's not getting through and it's not like wetting the wood on the bottom, but um, we have quite a few tears in this canvas and I swear to you guys, it has not rained or snowed or anything in Vegas since like 2019 and it's 2021. And this week that we've gotten this camper, it has rained and snowed and had more weather than we have had in the last two years. But um, it's not a big deal. It's really old and um, it needs work anyways, so. What are we doing today? Yeah, and super, super upsetting. We just opened up the canvas, the camper. And I don't know, it must have been the way that we stored the tent. Um, but it looks like the hole got about seven inches bigger. So that is super discouraging. Um, but we're just gonna learn a lot through this process of repairing that canvas. <laughs> Can't be trusted with anything, I swear. <laughs> So we were supposed to have a dinette table in this pop-up camper, but it did not have it when we picked it up. So we had to take some recycled wood. We sanded off the finishing and then we burned it to give it that really rustic look. Um, we were going to leave it just the way that it was until um, we found some polyurethane laying around the garage and we sprayed it and it just looks way more shiny and it looks like it's going to hold up a little bit better for camping and all of the dings and dents that happen during trips and kids and all of that good stuff. So for our giant hole that was in our canvas, um, the people before us had decided to just kind of fabric glue another piece of um, canvas fabric onto there. And it was coming off like crazy. It was not holding up very well. It kept ripping even more. So we knew that we had to do something a lot more sturdy if we were going to flip this. Okay. 
So earlier we um, used the tear mender and some canvas fabric and we pretty much glued all of this with some fabric, super heavy duty fabric glue, which was amazing. Um, so that is all drying now. Let's get them inside to see what it looks like. <laughs> Obviously, it's not going to stay very well. Okay, yeah, that's not going to stay very well. Okay, good to know. Not going to stay very well. Good to know. <laughs> so we're going to sew all of this shut right now. And uh, hopefully, it does what it's supposed to do. And then we patch that one up. Where'd you just get back from? I didn't go nowhere. Sure you had to go double check that measurements that you knew in your head so well. See? Did you hear something? This is why he yells. Alright, so we sewed everything up. The speedy stitcher. Not to so mind you, not so speedy. <laughs> not so speedy. <laughs> not even close. It took us like three freaking days. <laughs> um, but it all looks really solid. I think that we should have folded it in right here, babe. Should have folded in the sides and the bottom. Yeah. But it's our first time doing it. We can always go over it again. Whoever gets it next. Probably not gonna go over it again. Oh, I think it's gonna be the same color. Paint it. <laughs> oh, pretty good, babe. Wow. Get closer. your scooter I don't want you to buy all these chemicals go all right so the pop-up camper is all finished got some new tires on her we did these gave her a deep 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 cleaning new tires and we sewed her on up, patched her on up. Alright, let's go inside. I see what you mean. I see what you mean. <laughs> like my sticker there. I love your sticker. I love your table that you made. By hand from mostly recycled materials. It's amazing. So we redid all of the countertops. We just put contact paper over them. Thankfully, this is in like better condition than our, our new trailer seat. 